front where it says aims real big. All right, everyone, I'm out here in Warren, and just as I promised after doing the Tops video, I've come over here to Ponderosa. Now, I mentioned in that Tops video that I was on the fence about doing a video over there at that old Chase Bank that shut down, but there really wasn't a whole lot to see. Even though there's not going to be a whole lot to see here, too, this is just more aesthetically pleasing, in my opinion. And, I mean, Chase Bank closed? What, people just run out of money? Well, yeah, actually, in this economy, it's not hard to. Um, but anyway, that just blows my mind, that bank would close. Although PNC's closing them down left and right as well. But anyway, Ponderosa, an American-style buffet joint that had its glory days many years ago. In the 90s, they were kind of all over, and they just slowly shut down little by little by little. And, well, this one's been closed for a while now. I can't exactly remember how long... But I do remember wanting to do a video here like six months ago and never getting around to it. And well, I finally done it. And it's because I was motivated to do that Burger King. Thanks to my friend Joe that just did a video there. And then the tops, of course. And it's like, oh wow, they're right across the street from Ponderosa. So without further ado, let's check this out and see how it looks. Yep, good old Ponderosa. I'm wondering if the red's supposed to be like that on the letters. I guess so. Especially since the uh, sign looks like that as well. Close. Thank you, Warren. Couldn't have been closed for too long because I remember driving past this a while back and it was open. Don't know if it closed due to COVID or not, but it did close. And, wow, it's really dark in there. You can hardly see through the tent. Let's look through this one because there is no tent on the glass here. There you go. That's a little bit better. There's your buffet. And all its splendor. <laughs> Old school, too. I love it. Looks good. Looks decently clean. Needs a little TLC here and there. The carpet needs vacuumed. Maybe it could open up into something else, something nice. A family run joint, mom and pop style place. Get it to go with the phone number. That's really cool. That's actual neon too. Busy roadway too for this to be closed. I mean, you got lots of businesses all over and there's that Mexican restaurant I mentioned in the other video. That sounds really good right about now. We'll see though. Um, let's take a look. Let's take a look through that window there. What the heck? Wow, close up of the buffet. <laughs> okay, well we did that. Let's go around to the corner here. Ow, those rocks, man. Got blinds all up in these windows here. I like it though, I like how the corners lit up. Okay, you got blinds there, but not over here. That works, because now we can see see what I see nothing I see a brick that came out of the floor some siding that's been torn down not really sure what the, that up was for but okay that, 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 that I can't talk guess that would have been for a booth maybe a couple of booths over here perhaps or it was a waiter station cleaning station or they had a register there look at this little tiny window here like that Whoop. Now you get a close-up of that. Look at that. All that wood grain. How cool. <laughs> nice looking building anyway. Clean. It's just dated, but I like it that way, honestly. Take a look through here. Oh yeah, you get a straight shot all the way to the other side. All the way to the other side of the restaurant. What a bummer, man. Big parking lot. Lots of parking up front. Here on the side. And even on the other side and in the back. I think there was a tow truck back here. I think, yeah, tow truck's back here just camping. That's okay, though. 
leave them alone. They're probably on a lunch break. There's the back of the joint. Boy, they need to get somebody out here to trim those weeds. Yeah, definitely need a little TLC going on. Everything's still intact. The roof looks like it's starting to cave in about there a little bit. I don't know, maybe that's just an illusion. Yeah, see, this was the other side of the parking lot I was telling you about. Uh, let's do it. Let's let's peek through this window here. Oh, gotta go up high with that. There you go. Trying to block out as much light as I can. Cool. Oof. We'll go back around to the front now. Here's the entrance. Uh, doors open. Permanently closed. I, I, I would love to, but I really don't want to, especially if, I don't, I don't really want to do it. It, it seems too good to be true, honestly. There's a reason why that's like that. It seems too good to be true. So, I would rather not. I'm sure it would be fine, but I mean, you saw everything anyway, so that's wild that that's just in the door like that. I wonder why. I wonder how long that's been like that. But yeah, I, you know, I don't want to do it because you got the person in the tow truck camping back there and I don't want them freaking out if they see me go in there, so. Just not, not, not meant to be. You know, sometimes it's too good to be true and I'm going to assume that this would be. So, just understand that. Yeah, I, they probably wouldn't even care, honestly, but I'm good. But anyway, I hope you enjoyed that look here. Really hungry, but not getting anything here. All right, thanks for watching. All right, well, that's a wrap from there. That's a bummer, man. I would go in there, too. But, you know, sometimes your gut instinct tells you it's not a good idea. You should probably listen to it. That's where I'm at. So, something tells me it's too good to be true. So, we're just going to go with that. It's a bummer, kind of kills me, but and I know it disappoints you guys, but you have to understand my perspective. So, if the tow truck driver wasn't there, then yeah, maybe peek in real quick, but nah, not meant to be. There will be other places we'll be able to do that at someday, We'll find another abandoned place and it'll be like oh wow look at this like that arby's for ant for example but anyway i'm taking off thanks for watching everybody hope you enjoyed if you did give the video a thumbs up if you're not a subscriber feel free to subscribe to the channel for more content and i'll see you next time bye bye everyone